You are watching Jimarism, and we are back with a new little series where, well, it's a pretty classic game. Say hello to Plants vs. Zombies, the first game, the original game, and uh, the only game I've tried, and I've heard it's still one of the better ones. And it is a great little relaxation game, so we should be getting into this tower defense survival game and I hope you will enjoy this little journey and that you can use these videos to have some relaxation during your days or just some sleep or whatever you'd like because this is Jimmudism relaxation or a little more slow paced channel so, to start off, we of course have to make a Zombatar. On this little menu, uh, we can basically make an avatar that are supposed to look like us. Um, yeah, and that's pretty cool. I don't know really which, uh, which zombie color. You know, I have this little fun idea. I think that... What if I try to make myself as a Sombatar before we begin. I think that's a great way to kind of settle in and settle down in this little game. So, I have my red-ish hair color. Um, it's probably more like that now, but I want to color it more like this, so I'm gonna make it like that. And Let's see if they have... That's pretty similar, yeah? I wanna see... Do they offer my moustache? This one is the closest one. In the same color. I think that looks pretty much like me, actually. <laughs> Maybe not. I don't think... This is if I have had a really bad week. But since the rest of this character looks like a bad week, <laughs> I think that this is probably uh, accurate if it's a bad week. <laughs> I mean, it looks like a bad week, Jimmadism. Alright. Do we have. A <laughs> this is so smart. Right. Do we have any. Uh, Glasses which are similar to some I'm using. Not really. But I would want to get some of these. They look super cool. Right, so are we dressed in? <clears throat> Portrait. I think this uh, punk gear looks pretty cool. Do we have any accessories? Can't say. I use them. Now I think we're probably fine without any. So we sometimes use the white cap, but it doesn't look cool, so we'll skip on that. I'm gonna select a. I'm a night creature, so I'll select this one. And now we get a nice JPEG on our desktop. Well then, let's start the adventure, shall we? Very dramatic. PopGap Games presents Plants vs. Zombies. Ah, one of my favorite games when I was smaller. This is my lawn. And as you can see, I have perfect... I have a perfect little lawn. And we can collect some more sun. So, uh, basically... You need to uh, collect suns in uh, order to uh, 
well, you need the suns, and if you got the suns, you can plant trees because the suns are the currency. And of course, I have played this game, so I kind of know how to play it. <laughs> but since we started on level one here, well, we need to go through the tutorial. And after this, I hope you're considering to try Plants vs. Zombies yourself. You can buy it from Steam. I think it's on Humble Bundle as well. And the music is so nice. There's a very skilled uh, Japanese woman who's composed the music for Plants vs. Zombies. It's a super good. I don't remember the name though. Right. Kimbolism's house. So uh, now you know where I live, don't you? Oh yes, you do. Now you know. Sunflowers are very important. Try to plant three of them. The more sunflowers you have, the faster you can grow plants. Isn't that quite nice? I think I wanna have six sunflowers. I'm doing a little challenge for myself here because I wanna see if it's possible for me. Right. I think we need to invest in one of them. All right. Now I have six, okay. Let's see if this is possible. Very easy indeed. Um, I don't know if you watch some YouTube a lot, but there is this guy who's made some kind of kind of glitter bombs that kind of sprays glitter uh, on people trying to steal packages. Um, and I noticed in his videos about squirrels on his backyard. I don't remember the name of him, but it's it's pretty famous. And he's actually using music from Plants vs. Zombies 1, like this game, in basically all of his videos. It's kind of crazy, isn't it? I think it's pretty fun. I want to see how many suns we can plant. Oh look, there is my... <laughs> Wait, Jimodism's evil clone is attacking the true Jimodism's house. Oh no, future evil Jimodism is here to get Jimodism. Okay. Bloom, Doom, Seed. So, Bloom and Doom. Seed. Uh, well, anyways. Blows up all zombies in an area. Well, welcome back to Jimmy Desmond's house. Oh no, the traffic cone zombies. They are much more resilient. If you didn't know that. Pretty scary. Dun, 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 dun. Hmm. Okay. Oh no, now we need to uh, gather up some firepower, I think. But I wanna see, actually, can I survive this mission with only Cherry bombs. I wanna see. Okay. Alright. I'm gonna 
slow him down a little bit. No. Damn it. Okay, it reloads a little bit too slow actually. I don't think we can do it. So we've got to have a little bit, uh, a little bit of uh, <laughs> pea shooters to make this map, make this level not die, basically. Well then, I'm gonna plant a lot of flowers because I want to be able to afford all the flower, all the bones I can. Imagine. Oh no. Alright. We're just gonna <laughs> plant a lot. It's kind of fun to see also how many we can have. Like how many plants? We can just fill this area with uh, suns. I don't know if anything happens if we can reach a certain sun level before. There are some hidden things that are a little bit funny actually. It's a well made game. One has to say that for sure. And I think it makes for a pretty good relaxing game too. Dun, 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 dun. Oh no, our backbone. If I can eat three plants, it's kind of worth to just ignore it. If he eats more than that, we have uh, lost points. Oh, we have some. We have thousand. That's cool. <laughs> well, look, there I come. Or no, I mean my evil twin brother. Bjorn. Oh, look. Wow. Bloom, <laughs> bloom seeds. Gives me a little walnut. Blocks off zombies and protects your other plants. Isn't that quite adorable? Oh man. The temperature just got turned up a notch, didn't it? I think so indeed. And I wonder, is it possible, <laughs> can we survive this map with only, yeah, we're gonna plant it there and he'll just eat and I'm thinking we continue to plant sunflowers. And he can eat there for a while. And as soon as the walnut has regenerated, we're gonna plant new ones. Oh no, now comes a new one. Oh no, look at the poor walnut, it's looking sad. Poor thing. Perfect. Dun, dun, dun. So big screen now. I also love that this game is like an old format too. I'm 
Now we're actually advancing in. Ooh, man. This is gonna be a little bit difficult, I think. Ooh, looks hard to do this, actually. Ah. Oh. He just ate that, too. Only them two. I think we're gonna let him through and let the... Let the lawnmower take care of them. doing a little bit, we're doing a difficult challenge for sure. Oh no, and he's eating. Okay, I think we're gonna let the lawnmower take care of him too. I think we need to blow them up though. It's a little bit scary. See if we can. Uh, <laughs> we might need to get them with some lawnmowers too. We need to protect that area though. So if they go in where we don't have a lawnmower, they will eat our brains. So we need to be quite careful about that. Oh no. Oh man. Whoosh. Yes indeed, a little bit scary. Reload time is so slow, too. Well, we're gonna plant flowers along the lines where we can't afford to lose anything more. See if we'll let the. Uh, we need to save this. Okay. They can go in there. Alright then. Okay, the lawnmower will take care of him. Okay, this will be quite interesting. <laughs> oh no, okay, then I would go for the second one here. Mom. <laughs> Alright then. They eat so much faster up top there. Oh no. Soon we have. Okay, we need to use it there. Good. Right then. Right, I think we can. I think we might actually be able to complete this map. Because the walnut. Yeah, I think we can. Okay. Come on. <laughs> Aha. We replaced it with a new walnut very fast. There are some mini achievements and stuff like that. It's pretty funny. So it's not completely useless doing fun stuff like this. <laughs> it's pretty useless though. 
right. Oh, look. Oh my god. There we have a shovel. Let's see, dig up a plant to make room for another. Greetings, neighbor. My name is Crazy Dave. That's my neighbor. But you can just call me Crazy Dave. Wow. Listen, I got a surprise for you. But first, I need to uh, clear your lawn. I'll need you to clear your lawn. Use your shovel and dig up those plants. Let's let the digging commence. Okay. Click on the shovel. Click on the plant. Click on the shovel. Click on the plant. Click on the shovel. Click on no grass. No plant. And there we go. Good day for now. Now for the surprise. Oh, good. Now for the surprise. We're going bowling! Wow! Take this walnut! Why... I put the walnut in... Why did I put a walnut in your hand? Because I'm crazy. <laughs> now go! Bowl me a winner! Oh my god. <clears throat> oh, they're just rolling. Yeah. Let's bowl. <laughs> I love the sound of this bowling. This is explosive one. I think I want to keep that. Ah, you can see it kind of uh, bounces a little bit too. Wait. Won't they stack up? Yes, they will. Good. Wow. And there we go. There we go. And there we go. <laughs> How enjoyable. I think we can detonate it around here, right? Oh, very nice. Need to take care of that one. Should probably not have wasted my explosive ones, but well, it's fun. Oh yes. I think we need to use this now. Oh yes. Wonder if we should have uh, maybe left some explosive ones for the final wave. All right. Ah, uh, come on. That gang below here—they're a little bit scary. No, not all of them. Well then. There we go. And there we get something new. What is this now, you might wonder. Potato mine. Explodes on contact, but takes time to arm itself. Wow. You know what? I think... I think it's time we end this little episode. And I hope you enjoyed the first iteration of the um, Plants vs. Zombies first game. And if you did enjoy this, well, please subscribe and do like the video too, if you want anyone else to see it. And, uh, well... Other than that, I guess I see you next time with some more relaxing videos and gameplay and stuff like that. Well, see you next time. This is your host, Jim Odessim, signing out. <laughs>